What's going on, everybody? Happy Friday. Peace and love. Peace and love. It's time to talk about the new Rock Band 4 announcement we got today. Uh, we learned about the new patch that's coming out on December 8th. So we saw that IGN did a whole piece on it. They talked about the breakneck speed that's coming. Uh, so apparently breakneck speed, you can increase the increment by 0.25 and then it goes up to two and a half times you can do with breakneck speed. I'll put the link to IGN's article down below and they've got some videos as well. But the bigger news we learned is about the new mode that they've been teasing for the last month or so. So the new mode that's going to be showing up on December 8th is called Brutal Mode. And I guess the best way to describe Brutal Mode is it's kind of like performance mode in past Rock Band games. Uh, the difference being that you can actually still see the notes, but the better you play on Brutal Mode, the harder it's going to get. And IGN's got a whole seven minute long video on this. Uh, basically, the notes keep coming on the highway, but it looks like the timing window of when you hit it is like pushed further up on the music chart. Uh, the cool thing about Brutal Mode is that it's going to be like a separate uh, mode on the, song, on the uh, game menu, and you can only play it on Expert. Everybody who's playing the mode has to be playing on Expert. There, uh, no fail, you can't turn on. So if you're going to be able to fail out of songs in Brutal Mode if you don't play properly. The other thing we learned too is that apparently in Brutal Mode, you can't play freestyle guitar solo. So you'll have to play the charted guitar solo as well. So they want to make this mode as hard as possible. The other thing we also noticed in the uh, IGN feature is that the FC indicator was shown. So basically around the multiplier, uh, number you'll see like a gold ring and that will basically indicate that you're still FCing the song or you're on track to FC the song. Once you screw up then the gold ring will be taken away. We also learned that uh, Harmonix confirmed on Reddit that there will be a separate leaderboard for people who play Brutal Mode and then you'll also be able to accumulate a special type of red stars that indicate that you've played Brutal Mode and beaten a song on Brutal Mode as well. The other thing I noticed in the IGN video is that the track opacity has been like improved so it's not as shiny and it's much easier to read the notes. The other thing you'll see too is that the score, the more detailed score breakdown when you finish a song is shown as well. It looks kind of similar to what we saw in Rock Band 3. And then the last thing I finally noticed is that when you're playing a song and you set a new high score, uh, during the video on IGN, they showed like a new personal best little message will show up uh, while you're playing the song. So if you achieve a new high score, you'll be notified right away about it. I imagine the same will be said too if you beat one of your friend's scores as well. That basically did it for the new patch. I also got a tiny new bit of information about Rock Band VR, which was announced yesterday at the Video Game Awards for the Oculus Rift. A lot of people are wondering what platform this is actually going to show up on. And we actually had Palmer Lucky, uh, I guess who's the guy who was founder of uh, the project Oculus, he commented and said their company funded the actual Rock Band VR game, they produced it, and the hardware in interfaces with their tracking system. So basically expecting it on any other platforms would probably be ridiculous or unreasonable. So I think it's probably safe to say we won't see it on the PlayStation 4. It'll probably be an Xbox One or PC exclusive at this point. I don't really know what to make of this new Brutal mode. I don't think it's going to appeal to everybody, largely because not all Rock Band players play on Expert, so it's going to appeal to a small fraction of the audience. I feel like they should just focus on fixing the game before introducing new modes. Maybe that's what the following patches will address. Um, in regards to the other changes, I'm happy that we're seeing more detailed score breakdowns and that kind of stuff. I want to let you guys know, stay tuned to my channel. I'm going to have a full review of Brutal Mode, as well as show you what it looks like. And I want you guys to let me know, are you guys excited about Brutal Mode or are you guys not excited about it? Comment in the section below and subscribe for the latest Rhythm Gaming news. Take care.